Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for June the 16th of 2021, well, it is titled Scorpius Enhanced. So what do we see here? Well, here we are looking towards the constellation of Scorpius, the Scorpion. And the Scorpion is outlined by a set of bright stars, which indicate the hooked tail of the Scorpion. And it's a little hard to see in this image, so we can annotate it a little bit to highlight where the uh, scorpion's tail is. And you can see that the head of the scorpion would be towards the upper left hand side. Uh, the bright red star Antares at the heart of the scorpion and then the twisted tail of the scorpion going down towards the lower right. Now Scorpius is one of those constellations near the plane of our galaxy, which means there's a lot of dust and gas there. So a great detailed image like this will show lots of that dust and gas and we see that in our image today. Now the nebulae are three primary types. There are the emission nebulae in red, the bluer reflection nebulae and dark nebulae, which are dark colored. And we see all of those here in the uh, constellation of Scorpius. The red color of emission nebulae is caused by the emission from hydrogen gas, which causes it to glow. So the hot stars will excite the gas and cause it to glow. And hydrogen, when excited, will give off a distinct red color. The reflection nebulae are dust grains around stars that reflect the light and they primarily reflect the blue light giving the, the reflection nebulae that blue color. The dark nebulae are darker regions around and those are denser areas where the dust is denser and we cannot see through them with visible light. So you can't look when you look at an optical telescope such as the image here you can't see through those. However if you could look in the infrared at a longer wavelength you could be able to penetrate through the dust and get a better idea of what is going on inside. And what we find is happening is that stars are forming there when we see the reflection nebulae and the emission nebulae and the dark nebulae we know that all sorts of star formation is going on and that is something that happens in a spiral galaxy like our own Milky Way where the dust and gas are concentrated we will get more uh, star formation and that includes in the regions of the sky around the constellation of Scorpius. So here in our picture today we get to see those three different types of nebulae scattered across Scorpius the scorpion. So that was our picture of the day for June the 16th of 2021. It was titled Scorpius Enhanced. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then have a great day everyone and I will see you in class.